Hello, fourth grade. Welcome to the Enschwinger tour. I don't know how to say it. Uh, low part video. So today we're going to be working on the low part of this song. Um, maybe you were working on other parts. I don't know. Or maybe this is the one that you wanted to work on. Um, first thing we need to do, of course, is work on the rhythm. So we're going to do rhythms, pitches, chin play, and then practice. So rhythms are first. Here we go. One, two, ready, go. Two, 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 two. It's getting repetitive. Two, 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 two. Mm. Mm -hmm. Just at the end. So this dot, this two with a dot is a tomb. Um, it is three beats long. So it's two is two beats long, but the dot adds one more beat. So together it's worth three beats. And then there is the rest. So there, this one should only be held three beats at the end. So rhythms were pretty simple, but if for some reason you struggled with any of those, you might want to go back and look at them. Second up, and but if you've got it, let's move on. So note names, let's do it. Starting on G. One, two, ready, go. G, F sharp. Gonna to have to learn F sharp. Let's just go back. Do, well, actually, let's just look at it now. Do you see this? So that's F sharp. That's a sharp. Do you see how it's on the F line? Every good boy does fine. F. It's on the F line. F sharp. So that means any time that there is C, it's the same here. Any time there's an F, even though this is not the same F, like this is high F and this is low F, it doesn't mean it doesn't matter. This F is sharp. So we don't play regular F. We play F sharp. I'll show that to you later. But for now, say F sharp every time there's an F. So this will be an F sharp. That'll be an F sharp, right? Let's try. <clears throat> Speaking the note names. One, two, ready, go. G, F sharp, E, D, E, F sharp, G, D, G, F sharp, E, D, E, F sharp, G. Okay, so now let's do chin plane. So for chin plane, let's first figure out that F sharp. So we know that this is F. F sharp is this. So F sharp, here's G up here. And then again, F is here. We're gonna keep the bottom finger, but we're gonna switch it. So this is F sharp. One, two, three, skip the first finger, second, third, and second and third finger. Regular F, F sharp. So anytime there's an F, we're gonna play F sharp. Let's try chin play. One, two, here we go. G, F sharp. E, D, E, F sharp, G, D, G, F sharp, E, D, E, F sharp, G. Now, if that worked well for you, you're ready to move on, but if not, pause the video, practice. I'm guessing some of you are going to struggle with the F sharp. So if that was a struggle for you, just go back and practice. Pause the video, work on it. Go back and try it again with the chin playing with me. Um, watch my fingers if you're not sure what to do. But make sure that you've got that. If you've got it, let's move on. Playing slowly. One, two, really slow. easy for you, you're ready to move on. If not, pause the video, practice, and see what, what was a struggle. Practice the struggle for a little while. Try it with the video again. If you've got it, you're ready to move on. Let's try it a little bit faster. I hope you noticed that uh, those were pretty low notes. If you're finding yourself squeaking, remember you really need to make sure you fully cover the holes. If you don't fully cover the holes and there's some like little spots where your finger's not fully on the hole, it's gonna squeak. Second problem, 
breath. If you're blowing too hard because they're low notes, you need even less air, especially that D down below. That low D, really, really just a little bit of air. So if you struggled with that, you might wanna go back and look at that too. All right, moving on a little bit faster. One, two, here we go. If you've got that, we can move on. If not, go back and practice that. Do it a couple times until you've got it nice and smooth. If you've got it, let's try it with the recording. So the phone is going to play the high part and we will play the low part. Let's try. One, two, to post in your seesaw. So go ahead and find your seesaw. There's an activity there waiting for you that says just click the record button and record your what you did today. Um, if you have any questions, email. I hope you had a fun and then maybe you'll listen to watch another video and work on another part. Um, if not, I will see you next week. Bye!